The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 753 pounds. The Raw Tag Team Champion, Gavin Coral Z and Brian M. Dudes with Attitude. Hey guys, this is an incredibly important match for the champion. Yeah, that's right, Cole. Despite the title not being on the line, the last thing he wants to do is show any sort of weakness here. Because you can bet there are guys in the back studying his every move. The Undisputed Era is here! Cole O'Reilly and Fish, the most elite superstars in the entire world. here with one thought in mind to shock the system sit back and enjoy guys it's not every day you get to see six big time names like this in the same match i don't know where adam cole gets the nerve and thinking he can come in and take what he wants saxton he doesn't just want to take everything adam cole wants to rule the entire oh. industry Tag team matches have been a staple of competition since the early days of sports entertainment. Two teams of three compete against one another under traditional tag team rules. Stipulations can be added like no disqualification, two out of three falls, elimination, falls count anywhere, or whatever else someone could think of. Matches can also be held in a caged environment. 
There may be no preventing the... There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Six-man tags can be fought under so many different types of stipulations. Teams can be part of a faction. The three superstars have aligned things of a common interest. The most crucial aspect to a six-man tag team being successful is that trio's ability to act as one cohesive unit. Three individuals working collectively at all times. So much can take place during a six-man tag match. Regardless of what type of match the teams of three are competing in, the members of that team must be on the same page. Oftentimes, the teams who have the best continuity are the most successful. Something that is always important in a six-man match is having the ability to perform double-team moves. One of the things that successful six-man teams try and execute are double-team moves and then have the third team member perform a signature or finishing maneuver to deliver maximum impact. Uh, I think this is the beginning of the end. This might not have been a wise move for him here, Michael. Teamwork is always paramount in a six-man tag match. Superstars want to be able to have a level of teamwork where two members of the trio perform a double team move and the third member follows that. He forces his way free. Man, he just has so much resolve. Irish whip. Lariat. Oh, flying forearm. That'll turn your lights out. Thanks to Raw General Manager Kurt Angle in May of 2017, the WWE Universe saw a dream team come together when the Hardy Boys joined forces with the Lunatic Prince Dean Ambrose. The exciting trio took on Sheamus, Cesaro, and The Miz. Truth be told, both Miz and Ambrose blended in with their impromptu tag team partners pretty well. Irish Whip! We always make a point to talk about continuity amongst team members. In the six-man match, where Dean Ambrose teamed with the Hardys against Sheamus Cesaro and The Miz, both teams worked very well together. That surprised me since this was the first time they teamed together. But there was something that night about the lunacy of Dean Ambrose fitting perfectly with the Daredevil Hardy Boys. I've got to say, I had goosebumps for a week after the Hardy Boys returned to WWE. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. up to this point, but that can obviously all change here. Oh, what impact. Ooh. Is it enough, though? How is Adam Cole going to remain alive? He'll find a way. The strength of the Undisputed Era group can be linked back to his leader, Adam Cole. The trio is built beautiful technique. Oh, oh, it's over. How is Adam Cole going to remain alive? He'll find shoulders on the mat. And he breaks up the pinfall. Let's keep fighting. Backdrop suplex. We have to give credit where credit is due. The vision Adam Cole utilized to create the Undisputed Era was genius. Adam Cole knew exactly what was needed to invade NXT and earn big opportunities. Wow, you actually made sense, Byron. Congratulations. Adam Cole looked to men he knew as allies and enemies and united them for one common cause, domination. Tagged in. Max Handle finds the mark. There are instances when a six-man tag match will feature a team where superstars have not always seen eye-to-eye eye, or are in the midst of a disagreement. 
When that's the case, someone on the team must step up and be the voice of reason so the trio can function as a cohesive unit. Gets the tag. Corey, earlier you talked about what needs to happen when members of a six-man team have differences or had differences in the past. If the team can't find a way to get on the same page, they will not last very long. Someone on the team has to step up and make sure for at least that match, everyone on the team can work together. Well, that's easier said than done. Just because superstars might be favorites of the development. In 2016, the New Day found themselves in the middle of a sick and twisted rivalry with the Wyatt family. Things escalated to the point where Bray Wyatt invited the New Day to do battle at the Wyatt family compound. New Day accepted, but what followed was something no one expected or will ever be able to forget. Oh boy, he is rolling. Corey, we talked about six-man tag matches, and earlier you talked about one that caught the attention of the entire sports entertainment world. The New Day fought for survival amongst the darkness of the Wyatt family compound in a battle where pickaxes and cinder blocks were used as weapons and automobiles were used as battering rams. The New Day versus the Wyatts at the Wyatt. Setting it up. Now, brain buster. This could be the turning point, Cole. And the odds just swung in Kyle O'Reilly's favor. You gotta believe this one's over. He's looking at it. Perfectly executed, guys. Bodies are not supposed to bend that way. He fights his way free, but how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? When a superstar is in a six-man match, one of the most important things to remember is knowing when to tag out and get the fresh member of your team in the ring. We've talked about continuity many times on this program, but it's more than that. You don't want to try to do too much when you have other members of your team out there. Tagged in. Point of the elbow, nailed it. superstars in six-man action and how crucial it is that they have the presence of mind to realize when they need to tag out. Not everyone who... Oh, look! A flying fish hook! This one's over, guys! Bobby Fish may have just ended it. He goes for the cover. And he breaks the pin. Hiring out and for the DDT! Fight! He's looking banged up here, guys. And it looks like things are about to get even worse. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Huge toss. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Shoulders on the mat. One. Two. Looking to catch him off guard there, I guess. I think Bobby Fish's tenacity here is coming from his days training under Harley Race. In off the tag. Stop. Good grief. 
He's looking a little off balance. He's got to remember he has two partners ready to enter the fray here. Consider me wildly unimpressed with his performance here tonight. I mean, he's just getting destroyed in there. In a back-and-forth match like this, he has to do everything in his power not to let his opponent gain too much momentum here. Irish whip! He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Right across, double axe handle smash. Here it comes. Looking for the choke slam. Victory is on the horizon. Yeah, you don't see a slam like that very often. Oh, tear the features clean off your face. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. Wow, what a leg sweep. Oh, crushing the knee here. Comes in off the tag. Only got one. Make the last shot count. Now he's got. There's the cover. Can he do it? What an amazing six-man tag match. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. Look at him go. He's getting after it here. Check him out here. And here's the last look at this one. Here are your winners. Adam Cole, Kyle O'Reilly, and Bobby Fish. The Undisputed Era. That's a win worth celebrating. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. Folks, we just saw one of the most exciting matches you'll see anywhere.